Good morning. Although I'm unable to attend in person, I'm absolutely delighted to be able to welcome you to the Sustainable Urban Fringes Conference and to Aberdeen. Now, I understand that many of you are not from Scotland, so as Deputy First Minister, I'd also like to take this opportunity to welcome you to Scotland. I hope that you are able to make some time outside of the conference to enjoy all that Scotland has to offer. You might have heard recently that Scotland is the backdrop for some very famous movies. The overall purpose of the Scottish Government is sustainable economic growth. And to deliver that, we need healthy city, regional, rural and island economies right across our nation. Our urban fringes are a vital part of that mix. And I'm delighted that you are all here today to explore how to make better connections between the urban and the rural. In my capacity as Cities Minister, I've been working with Aberdeen and with Scotland's other cities, Dundee, Edinburgh, Glasgow, Inverness, Perth and Stirling. Taken together, cities and their regions deliver two thirds of Scotland's GVA and produce 62% of all Scotland's exports. As one of Scotland's seven cities, Aberdeen is vital to our economy. It's also an exemplar of how to forge strong and enduring links with its neighbours. The Aberdeen City and Shire Economic Future is a powerful example of how to work effectively in partnership with others towards shared goals. The Scottish Government established the Scottish Cities Alliance, a key part of our economic strategy in December last year. The Alliance is a partnership of the seven city local authorities and the Scottish Government, facilitated by the Scottish Council for Development and Industry, which aims to bring more investment, more businesses and more jobs to our cities and to their regions. As a partner in the Alliance, Aberdeen has the opportunity to achieve economies of scale in procurement and attract larger scale investment. Aberdeen will also have access to the Scottish Government's £7 million Cities Investment Fund. This fund will help develop collaborative programmes that promote growth, lever investment and protect and create jobs across Scotland's seven cities and their regions. I welcome initiatives like the Sustainable Urban Fringes Project, which highlights the role of the urban fringes in unlocking the potential of our urban assets and the role they can play in delivering more sustainable and competitive cities. In Aberdeen, the River Dawn Corridor project is an asset to Aberdeen's economy and I'm encouraged to see such an approach being developed. And of course, the clear benefits of Aberdeen's work in this area are not only recognised by the Scottish Cities Alliance, but there is an opportunity for cities across Scotland and beyond to learn from and replicate these successes in their own urban fringes. The Alliance exists to increase the investment, businesses and jobs in our cities. In focusing on our cities, we do so as a catalyst to deliver wider benefits for the city regions and for all of Scotland. We need healthy city, regional, rural and island economies to deliver sustainable growth across our nation. And we need sustainable urban fringes. So I really hope you enjoy all the conference has to offer and indeed all Scotland has to offer. Please enjoy your discussions.